Hello everyone, I'm Dr. H. Today I'm going to talk about tinnitus and the sound therapy. We know tinnitus as ear ringing. You hear ear ringing with no external sound. Some sufferers can hear tinnitus 24-7. Some patients become not able to work just because of the ear ringing 24-7. For them, tinnitus is really annoying. Fortunately, we have few methods to treat tinnitus. One of them is commonly used, so-called sound therapy. Basically, tinnitus sufferers can listen to different kinds of sounds, like music, noise, or other prescribed sounds. We can listen to the sounds 3 to 20 minutes per day, 3 to 7 days a week. Whenever we hear the ear ringing. So next I'm going to introduce the theory behind the sound therapy. Why? Why sound therapy is effective to treat tinnitus? This is believed to be due to masking, masking effects. Masking has been studied well and widely in psychoacoustics. Psychoacoustics is a cross field of two science fields, psychology and acoustics. Particularly, masking is an effect that has been found for more than 40 years. What is masking? If we look at this block diagram, we will see that for simultaneous masking, we have tinnitus going on in our brain or in the ear. If we play music at the same time, Oftentimes, we don't hear tinnitus anymore during this period. So this is called simultaneous masking. It's a good example to show how masking works. Essentially, ear ringing is inaudible when music is played. So if A and B are present simultaneously. The louder one masks out the softer one. In this case, if I have tinnitus, I listen to a music louder than my tinnitus, then my tinnitus is not there anymore during the period. That can give temporary relief to my suffering. Then simultaneous masking is not just applied to tinnitus treatment. It's a general uh, phenomenon in the field of hearing research. For example, we know that when we play a one kilohertz tone, if at the same time another 1.1 kilohertz tone is played, we don't hear 
the second tone. If the second tone is lower in volume, that has been well studied and established. Another example, we have two tones, one is uh, 440, the other one is 450. If we play one tone, then another, most people can tell the difference very quickly and easily. That means if we play them sequentially, we can hear there are two different tones. So they can be perceived clearly when played separately. Our brain, our central processing system, or auditory cortex can tell the tones apart easily when they are present simultaneously. However, if, if we play them at the same time, at the same time, our brain cannot perceive clearly there are two tones. So this is called simultaneous masking. Another major masking effect is called temporal masking. Temporal masking is basically a masking effect in time. There are two subcategories. One is backward masking. The other one is forward masking. Let's still use tinnitus as an example. If we have music playing, we stop the music, then patients, I meet those patients, they don't hear any tinnitus within some period after mask stops. So there is some period here. Even music stops, they don't hear any tinnitus afterwards. But remember, that's within a limit time. In general, music here is actually a masker, and the tinnitus is a signal. Our brain cannot find a signal if there is a masker preceding the signal. This is also observed in many tinnitus sufferers. I play music to them, even I stop. Music is not being played within a short period of time. They still don't hear tinnitus anymore. This is a forward masking effect. Reversely, reversely, we have backward masking, which means the masker is following the signal. That's very straightforward. So both are observed along time domain. So this is time. This is time. So the arrow is masking effect. This is also used in internet treatment. Okay, so temper masking, essentially a signal and masker are not presented simultaneously, but sequentially.
if the masker follows the signal, it's called backward masking. If the masker precedes the signal, it's called forward masking. Okay, so in summary, we see some tonight sufferers oftentimes benefit from sun therapy because masking. And we know that there are three kinds, simultaneous masking, forward masking, and backward masking. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.